Hey guys, we are now into the 66th topic input methods. This is going to be interesting because you know the answer but high chances you will select a wrong, wrong one. So let's see what are those questions. Okay. Before we get on to those questions, first of all, all these questions are framed. I have framed based on this table. Okay. Based on this specific page, I have framed the question. I would really allow you to read this. Okay. Carefully. Take your time, pause the video and read everything carefully. I have explained right uh, in, the, in the starting of this series, I have explained about input methods. Now this is the time to really test it. Okay. So I hope you have read it. Take your time, pause the video, read it. Okay. So let's get started with the questions. Okay. So right now you are not supposed to only condition is you are not supposed to go back to that page. You saw it, took your time. If you still want to go, please see it. Please see uh, the page. But why I'm saying people know the answers, but they might select wrong answers because of lot of text involved. You know, our mind might choose a wrong answer. So let's see. Let me ask you this first question. A developer would like to implement, a developer would like to implement the fastest uh, with background execution okay it should be the fastest and with background execution which input method will best suit his requirement so he, what is the keyword here fastest with background execution so what is the fastest which one out of all this windows message simulate hardware events all of the above so here the answer is quite simple the answer is simulate right so this is the answer okay great let me see this question let me see how many of you can really answer this and i want you to really type your answer okay for question number two answer is two like that you type okay or one or four whatever you think so let me read this question what is true about hardware events input method so which input method we saw there are four uh, three different input methods right windows message simulate type and click hardware events so for hardware event the answer is what is true about Okay, what is true? So you saw the table carefully, right? Okay, so let's see the options. What are the first option? 100% compatible and can auto empty field. Is it right? No background execution. No background. Okay, so how do you answer such questions? Okay, first of all, you read this hotkey support is there and cannot auto empty field. 90% compatible with no background execution. When such question comes, because there are a lot of text, you can highly get confused. Even though you know the answer, you might select the wrong one. Getting it? So how do you really tackle with this? So to tackle this, what you do when you are reading one sentence, right? Always divide. Okay. For example, hardware events. So you saw the table. What is the, what is there in the table? H, H means hotkey is there, something like that you have to create a memory clue. Hardware, because it's hardware, the speed is always 50%. Okay, and then it's compatible with 100% application. The hardware is compatible with all the uh, different applications, but speed is less, hotkey is there. So H, H, like that you have to create some memory clue. What is not there? Background execution is not there, auto empty field is not there. Okay, background execution is not there with hardware event and auto empty field when you are typing something right auto empty field is not there. So this much you have remembered after you remember this specific thing, you should read the question part by part. For example, first line, this one is 100% compatible. This half of the sentence is correct and can auto empty field. This is incorrect. So this is gone. So it is asking what is true, right? So this is wrong. Okay, next no background execution this sentence is correct speed is 80 percent no speed is 50 percent we just saw so this is also incorrect okay take your time don't be in hurry because you will always select the wrong answer okay hotkey support is there yeah h stands for hardware hh -H, hotkey support is there getting it i'm creating a memory clue to remember and cannot auto empty field correct it cannot do a see a is two times is there so i will remember okay auto empty field is not there with hardware events so and cannot auto empty field. So this is the right answer. 90% compatible 
is it 90 percent 100 percent compatible right so this itself is wrong so all three wrongs we've identified so the exact right answer we will be double sure yes this is the right answer getting it how to answer this okay let's see you need to answer this question okay what is not true about send windows message input method so remember not true true this also confuses our mind during the exam so not true that means you simply replace this with what is wrong right what is wrong about something like that hmm? wrong so now what is wrong so let's read this works with i'm talking about send windows message okay you read you take your time and read everything and tell me what is the right answer type it first you type it okay read this carefully and type it now let me explain okay so send windows message so how do you remember this one send windows message is almost a replica of the hardware events why because auto empty field is not there hotkey support is there okay it's almost a replica of hardware event just that what is the difference the compatibility is 80 percent remember compatibility is 80 percent very easy to remember background execution is there speed is also 50 percent so do you see this last three columns are the same almost the replica just that here bit of changes compatibility 80 percent hotkey support is there with send just remember send windows key is a replica of hardware events in terms of speed hotkey support auto empty field auto empty field they cannot do it auto empty is only available with simulate type okay so rem once you remember this then as i said with this kind of questions always read part by part don't read entire sentence then get confused no read part by part if it is one is wrong then remove that so what is saying we have to find a wrong here actually not the right that means three will be right one will be wrong so what is that let's see let's read the first one works with 80 this is correct this part is correct with background execution this is also correct okay this is correct okay leave it now let's read the second one speed is 50 percent this is also correct right hardware even both are 50 and hotkey support is also available this is also correct auto empty field with background auto empty field with background so auto empty field is not there right hardware event cannot also do auto empty field um, auto empty is only with simulate type so this is the wrong one look at the fourth one background execution with hotkey support hotkey support is there because it's a replica of a hardware event right so so what is the answer here three is the answer auto empty field with background execution okay read carefully because the sentence can be formed in any way you can imagine right there will be 100 ways to frame a sentence so remember to read each sentence slowly so that you don't choose don't expect any question to come in the exam okay this kind it could be very different sentences will be very different so all you need to know is remember the table and carefully read the question and the options let's see how you can answer this one now simulate click remember there are this table is also important 99 percent of the web apps 60 percent of the desktop apps remember this this is 880 this is 99 web apps 60 percent desktop app. this this is one very important background yes a uh, speed is highest 100 percent both were 50 50 hotkey support is only thing not there is hotkey support is not there but empty field is there okay auto empty is there hotkey support is not there okay remember that now let's answer background execution with 100 percent speed this is actually correct auto empty field with 99 percent web compatibility that is also correct 60 percent desktop apps compatibility this sentence is correct with no hotkey support this is also correct so what exactly is saying not true means what is wrong i told you when you see not true you should put in your mind it's wrong what is wrong so all three are correct so what is the right answer fourth will be the right answer background execution without hotkey uh, background execution without hotkey support so hotkey support is there huh? sorry i think i did not frame the question properly it should be with hotkey support okay this is the wrong one background execution with hotkey support hotkey support is not there okay but background is so this should be your right answer getting it so why i am framing this kind of a question because our mind will get confused with the sentences okay so before the exam just ensure you have remembered it properly if any question comes you know how to answer it so thank you guys let's move on to our next topic